Good morning, you guys. Another day. Another sickness. Um, not me, but Blaine. So, what's today? Tuesday. Um, so Blaine. Okay, this is how his he's been working. What's been going on with him? So he came home. Oh, so okay, he had a cough. So he's been sick for like two months. He had a cough for like a month. And then he got sicker, and that's when he had, when I took him in, and it turned out he had a cold. So the cough, I don't know if it was part of that cold, if it was something else, whatever. Yeah. So he had the cold, then he was better, and then all of a sudden he got the pink eye. So then we did the round of the seven-day treatment, and he was better. And all of a sudden, yesterday after school, he came home, took a really long nap, and uh, I felt like I could smell something weird. Um... <clears throat> took a really long nap and woke up with a fever of like 103 so then I gave him Motrin and I brought the fever down then he had a fever in the middle of the night so I gave him Motrin again and then he had a fever again this morning so I gave him Motrin and he's been actually feeling sick this time like whereas when he has colds I feel like he he's sick but he doesn't like act as sick uh like you know how kids are and um he, but yeah, he was like, kept saying, Mama's sick. Like, like he was really sick. And he was even like to a point where the TV's on and he's just staring at the wall. Like, you know, when you're really sick, like, like you don't even really want to watch TV. You don't want to do anything. Like, you just want to lay there. That's what he was doing. So I did email. <clears throat> I mean, well, I messaged the teacher, tell him he's not coming. But I, and I also asked her if there's like a lot of sicknesses going around. Because I don't, <clears throat> I don't know. And, but I emailed. That his doctor, just letting her know the whole, because she hasn't seen him. I've been doing, going to the walk-in, but just like how he was sick from, for like a couple months. And just explain the whole thing to her. <sighs> and just like express my worries because when he was in the children's hospital a couple years ago with RSV, um, he, it, like a big part I think of that too was that he, had so many sicknesses on top of the RSV and that was like really making him struggle so if he's like so I don't know if this is all one sickness if this is a bunch of different ones and that's happening again so I just asked her opinion so we'll see what she said um but anyways other than that it's gonna be a good day okay <laughs> it is raining so I don't know it's gonna be that great I'm gonna work on inventory today um, it sucks because I probably can't do, well, actually, no, Willie's duck hunting right now, and he has a rain day, so he might be home, so I can probably do deliveries later. Um, oh, I got a new message from the doctor's office already. That was quick. I'm going to be seeing you can schedule through my theta care account, or, okay, well, I'll schedule him an appointment, but can I get him in right away? That's the problem. Uh, well, I'm going to call them, so... going to start prepping dinner right now I'm gonna make tater tot casserole for dinner and then so I'm to make it low carb I'm gonna do tater tots on half of the casserole and the other half I'll do tater tots not even half I'll do 
tater tots on most of it, and then I'll leave a portion for myself that does not have tater tots. Um, it's 2.22. I have to go get Jack at 3.15. Blaine has a doctor's appointment at 3.45. We're going to go get him seen um, just because he can't kick this fever. He has had this fever now since yesterday. Um, and I'm, I don't know. He's probably just got some type of sickness that it's going to have to run its course. But because it, he has been sick for like two months, I, I figure I should get him in. Um, and every time I give him Motrin, uh, and it starts kicking in, he's like up and at him. He's like doing stuff, whatever. And then... But then once that wears off, then he's like, Mama, I don't feel good. So, yeah, it's... Because Motrin, it, I mean, it helps with the fever and it helps them to feel better. But it doesn't cure their sickness, you know? It's not... It's not like it's... They're not... Yeah, it's not curing their sickness. It's just make... It's just masking the symptoms is really all it is. But I'm going to brown up this meat. Trying to remember how to make tater tot. I know I need cream of cream of mushroom or cream of chicken. I don't remember. Um. So yeah, we're gonna brown this, and then yeah, and just get. And then I'm gonna put the shoot. I don't have the tater tots. That's okay. I'll have to. thinking I don't know I don't think I actually never mind I was thinking that was the problem <laughs> I was thinking okay so we're gonna brown this and I'm going to cook it and then just have it in the dish ready to go so that when I get home I can just throw it in the oven because yeah I have his doctor's appointment I don't really know how long that's gonna take um, if you're wondering what I ate for lunch because I haven't vlogged for a while now. I ate chips and dip. Not my finest moment, but it's the truth. <laughs> I had uh, cheddar, sour cream, potato chips, and French onion dip. Yes, that is what I ate for lunch. So, oops, but it is what it is. What are we gonna do? Um, I am I am trying to eat better. <laughs> I really am, but it's hard when you have, like, because we had that packer party, so it's like we have all this leftover, like, dip and stuff, so it's, like, hard. Um, so, yeah. In case you were wondering what I ate for lunch. check it out okay so here we go and then I'm gonna stick this just in the oven to uh, actually no I'm gonna stick it in the fridge because um, I don't know how long I'll be gone and then like I said when I get home I'll put the tater tots on top and then bake it and I might actually end up what did I step on oh a carrot I might just end up baking it or putting tater tots on all of it because I'm not really that hungry. I might not even eat any of it. Or maybe I'll leave a little section without it, but yeah. Or I could just put the tater tots on all of it and then scoop the tater tots off of my portion. I don't know. I'm not really that hungry and I feel like I really messed up today eating-wise. I'm not going to lie. So like I almost don't want to eat supper. Okay, but I'm going to run the laundry mat really quick. 
Yes, buddy. Okay, sorry. So I meant to record dinner better <laughs> than I did. Um, but it ended up getting really busy, chaotic. Um, so I went to Walmart, let Blaine pick some stuff up for his dad. And then we went and got Jack, went to Blaine's doctor's appointment. He tested positive for strep. So he had strep. So my prescription was ready. So I went and picked it up. And then they said, does he swallow pills? And I said, no, like, definitely not. And she's like, yeah, we wondered about that. She, The doctor sent in a pill prescription. So they're like, we need to contact the, um, the doctor or whatever to get a new prescription. So they contacted a nurse who said she was going to send it in right away. And I waited there for 45 minutes waiting. Come find out she never sent it in. So then I left and I called and they said that they can't now get one in. It probably won't be till because the doctor left. So it won't be till tomorrow. So mm, I was not happy about that. Actually, I was, let's just say I was pissed off because I want him to get this antibiotic in his system as soon as possible. Like he doesn't feel good, you know. So it really actually, I was not happy. Um... So I'll just have to give him some Motrin tonight. I didn't even know his throat hurt. I don't even know if his throat does hurt. He's He hasn't really complained about a sore throat. He's just had his fever, but I was like, he fell asleep on the couch, and it's only 6.45, and he took like a pretty long nap today, so you can tell he's sick, but he fell asleep on the couch, and I feel like his nostrils are flaring, so like, I always get really nervous about like the breathing crap, but I don't know. Anyways, I am... I gotta do some more listings, and then I need to wash my face. I didn't shower today, and I'm like, yeah, it needs to get washed. And I'm gonna do some listings, and then probably just go to bed. And wake up tomorrow and try to get his gosh darn prescription. And then I might actually take this vlog into tomorrow, because I don't even know if I've recorded much at all today. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see. Good morning, everybody. Um, so today is Wednesday. I so I'm supposed to clean my this Airbnb one of these days this week. I don't know when. I really don't want to. Huh? It's in the washer. It's I can't get it. It's washing. Um, so Blaine's staying home today. So, which I think I said yesterday, he can't go to school. Um. I know, buddy. But I should update you guys. So last night at like 7, so the pharmacy closed, because you guys know I had a lot of issues to get his prescription. So the pharmacy closes at 7 p.m. Well, at like 6.53, um, one of the girls that works there actually messaged me on Facebook. Messaged me on Facebook to let me know that they had finally gotten his prescription and asked if I want if I want them to fill it to and come get it quick. Um, and I was like, I don't know if I'll have time to get there by 7. It was only like 8 minutes, um, 7 minutes. And she, and I was like, you know what, actually, yeah, if you guys want to, and I'm going to come get it quick. And so I rushed down there. I got there at 6.59, um, just through the drive-thru. Oh, here, let's get... Um, and... Yeah, so I got his prescription, so he got to start a dose last night, which I was so thankful that she messaged me. I actually know her through going to the bars, actually. Like, we used to go out, and she was always out, too. Because before Blaine, we used to go out quite often, actually. We would go out every other, because we didn't have Jack every other weekend. So the weekends we didn't have him, we'd go out a lot. Um, and, yeah, so that's how I know her. Here, look. Can Mama, now Mama's got to do it. Um, so I was, and I don't know her, like, super personally, but I thought that was so cool of her to message me, um, because I, I actually really appreciate it, because Blade was really sick last night, and I felt so bad for him, and now, you know, it's almost 8 a.m., and close your teeth, and he's got two doses in him, all because she messaged me and let me know that, so that was really cool of her. Um, close your teeth. Um, 
Otherwise, he would have. I would. I wouldn't even have the first dose in him yet because pharmacy don't open till nine. So I'm just so glad he got that in. But today is Willie's birthday. It's November sixth. Um. So I'm gonna go to the store with Blaine and get him. Uh, so Willie loves shrimp alfredo, so I'm gonna make some shrimp alfredo. Not and not this nasty jar alfredo sauce. I don't like jar alfredo actually. No, at least. Um, no. I'm gonna make like yeah, uh, yeah, alfredo yeah, copycat because yeah. that's like his favorite meal. So no. not keto friendly, but that's okay. Um, so that's what I'm going to do right now, and then I do have a couple things on my agenda, but Blaine, he's he's something. He's feeling much better today, I think. So. Yep, happy Wednesday. Oh. I feel like I should be chugging my water. I I thought, okay, so I wasn't, I was feeling a little off this morning. I'm like, am I like getting sick again or just feeling sick again? But then I'm like, oh, maybe it's because Blaine woke me up super early at 5 a.m. Which, I don't know, I was actually more extra tired this morning. I just felt like crap when I woke up, like really tired. And then... When I was at Walmart, I'm like, dang, I actually don't think I feel very good. So I'm like feeling all right, whatever. It's not like terrible, but. So I went to my storage unit at Walmart. I got stuff for dinner tonight. But Willie did not tell me. I asked him this morning, what do you want for dinner? He said he didn't care. And I was like, oh, I was going to make shrimp Alfredo. That's his favorite. And he didn't say anything. And then all of a sudden I called him and asked what time. He wants me to make the stuff because I just bought the stuff. And he said, oh, I forgot to tell you. My mom wants to take me out for dinner. She told me last night. Out to Mexican. Or, like, all of us. And I'm like, thanks, Willie. <laughs> thanks. So, I just bought all this stuff. But we're not going to. We're not going to be making it. Um, so let's, I'll just do a quick little haul for you guys. Yeah, I don't know. I just feel like. I think I just need a little bit of rest and then I'll be fine. But, so I got him, which we'll have to save this for another day, but I got him this for his cake. Um, because I'm sure he'll get something at the restaurant. <clears throat> so we got that. Let me see. Blaine got a gun. A Nerf gun. Oh, because it's in the wrong way. This has to be on the same side as this. See? And then you pull this out. And now shoot. But don't shoot at people. No, no, the deal? Yep, go ahead. Okay, so we got that. And every I mean I can save everything. I can put that in the freezer. But the only thing is I got the salad kit. This I cannot. It's good till November 15th. So maybe. I don't know. Sometimes they're salads. You, you want to eat them up right away. So we'll see how that goes. Um, it didn't work. Then Blaine picked out a lunch bowl. I figured that'd just be a nice, easy lunch for him. We needed more sliced cheese. He wanted watermelon. At, he's like Yesterday and today, he's been really wanting watermelon. I think because he saw it on TV. Here. What's up? Not working because okay, so we're just gonna stick it in. And this you have to. Oh, it's jam. Okay. Now pull this back all the way. Can you do it? Here. But and then I think you push back. Now you can shoot. Or maybe yeah, you weren't supposed to push back. It didn't work. Yeah, I think I did. Here, come here. Nerf guns. Come on. I think where I went wrong was. Oh, your donuts in there. Okay. And then I got some, just these individual chicken breasts. I thought these would be good for lunches. 
And then I thought with the shrimp alfredo, Jack doesn't like any kind of seafood, so I thought I could just make one of these chicken breasts for him and then he could have chicken alfredo. Um, and then here's the shrimp I, oh, yuck. It's like, oh man. Okay, here's the shrimp, but I don't want to tilt it, it's leaking. Yeah, I'll get it for you. Let's just figure this out. Okay, we'll have to figure. Uh, what a mess. Here, come on, you got. I want you to move all this stuff because the counter's a mess now. Here, go down there. Go somewhere else. Uh, wait, stop. I will. Uh, I'll what? Okay, let's just finish this all quick. Heavy whipping cream for the Alfredo. Needed some more milk. So I got some more milk. And then the two cheeses that it needed was. Parmesan and then Romano, but I couldn't find Romano, so I got Asiago, and that's like a Asiago is like a good substitute for Romano. But I was surprised I didn't have Romano, so that's everything I got. And I'm gonna clean up this shrimp mess. And then I forgot to share. Also, we went to the gas station, so I got this winter edition sugar-free. It's iced vanilla berry Red Bull, and it's not bad. I kind of like it. And then I got an eggnog, just a cute little one, because this stuff is so bad for you, but. I like it sometimes, and I don't like it others. I don't know. Like, it's like one of those things, too, I feel like you can only take a couple sips, and you're, it's just so rich and thick. Mm -mm. I should see if Blaine likes it. Let me give him a little cup of it. Let's go see what he thinks of eggnog. Do you want to try eggnog? Try it. Just try a sip. Mom, drink it. Try it. You might like it. It's like chocolate milk. Let's take one sip. Just, it's like chocolate milk. Okay. Well, I guess that's not gonna work. Okay, but I'm gonna go put this stuff away. I am so mad because I totally realized I forgot. I checked the car and it's not in there, so I forgot at the store. I got linguine, however you say that. It's like a fettuccine noodle, but dinner which th that was only 98 cents for a pack of it so it was wh like whatever but I got doubled egg salad <laughs> that was pre-made by Walmart I'm so mad I forgot it I could probably call actually but I don't feel like it I I kind of want to just lay down Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door You don't have to wake up yet We can spend all day in bed I'll put the TV in the room We'll have a Netflix Marathon, KG saxophone We'll order in a bunch of food I'll put your favorite music on All the way baritone yeah. Shut the lights, go in front Wake up 